walk after work. I stop by the library and return the artist way and then one of the books on botanical art I had borrowed. So yeah, I didn't really do anything with the artist way in the end. It looks really interesting and that might be a process I might want to do at some point, but right now, I don't know, it's just too much and I'm not willing to come to um, wake up earlier for that, I guess. I'm not a morning person and I do wake up, you know, a good an hour and a half and a half before I have to work. I work from home, so I don't have to go anywhere. So that's a lot of time saved right there. But I also do a energy routine. I do some yoga, sometimes a meditation. I started including a little breathing session. And then I'll write what I'm grateful for. I do a little doodle these days. So I do a bunch of things as my morning routine, besides the obviously getting ready part. <laughs> uh, so the artist way somehow doesn't fit in that routine at this point, but maybe someday. It's an interesting, it's an interesting uh, book for sure. Yeah, it's nice to get some fresh air. I haven't been outside. I was going to go outside yesterday after work and then instead I took a nap. <laughs> I was just so tired. My energy has been kind of all over the place lately. I guess that's okay. So I haven't filmed much this week because I actually spent a lot of time behind my computer. So that's really boring for you to watch. I've been working on doing some research on something, which I'll probably talk about down the line. And then also I started doing my taxes because in the US it's tax season. I have another month to file my taxes, but obviously I want to start early and file early if I can just to get it out of the way. And yeah, so today I need to run a couple errands and then I want to sit down this afternoon and do a drawing because I haven't done any this week, believe it or not. I did work on my sketchbook a little bit, uh, just kind of practicing. I've been practicing drawing eyes a little bit and then just just kind of doodle stuff. Um, I've been keeping up with my daily doodle, but that takes like 10 seconds in the morning. <laughs> it's just kind of a fun thing. And yeah, so first let's uh, run some errands. I'm gonna take you with me and hopefully I can film what I'm getting and at least most of it. So yeah.
been trying to decide what to draw, and for whatever reason, I'm feeling stuck. I don't know why. <laughs> it's like, I don't know, I guess sometimes I get too many ideas and it gets overwhelming, or I don't want to repeat something necessarily that you've seen before. I don't know. So I'd like to do another moth uh, drawing like I did, is it two weeks ago already? And yeah, I'm, um, yeah, so my mind's going a little crazy right now. It's kind of like one of those situations where there's so many options or so many choices that it gets overwhelming, I guess. I'm not always good at making decisions because I can see the potential in everything. So then it gets harder to um, really make a decision, even in a simple thing like what am I going to draw next? I think that's pretty typical for highly sensitive people because, like I said, we can see, we have the vision for what it might look like. So yeah, and that made me think also of, um, I've been wondering about whether I'm bringing enough value to YouTube to my videos through my videos like I know I'm documenting my journey to becoming a full-time artist and yeah I'm hoping this actually brings value I guess I've been kind of second guessing myself but this was my intention from the beginning to document my journey as a self-taught artist uh, working to become a full-time artist and uh, especially a little bit later in life so you know I don't bring that up a lot um, but I'm hoping my journey uh, either is inspiring or maybe you can learn maybe I can teach a couple things along the way I'm thinking of maybe doing some mini tutorials I don't know there's a lot going on in my mind <laughs> trying to think where to go you know it's always I feel like the journey definitely isn't a straight line. There's always uh, going upwards and then sometimes feeling like you're sliding backwards and uh, yeah, going in circles a little bit. But I'm enjoying the journey and I hope you are enjoying watching me on the journey. And uh, yeah, but instead of rambling, I guess I'll figure out what to draw next.
If you're still here, thank you so much for watching this video until the end. I really appreciate it. This was kind of a short vlog this week. Uh, if you like watching my vlogs, I'll put the card for my vlog playlist right here if you want to watch more vlogs next. And in the meantime, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment, share the video with your friends and subscribe if you're not already. And I'll see you next week with a new video. Bye.